We are taking a look at Denmark right now. So um, everything's going to be predicated on this. What they want to do is they want to run a three. I'm going to call it a three, two, right? They're going to put three down and they're going to put two in the middle. Then we look at our apex players here and here. And what they're going to do with their apex, apex players is they expect them to go, uh, cover run to pass edge to flat, which means they're peeking in the backfield first, right? They're squeezing and then they're getting into the flat to cover the pass. That is their undoing. That's what they have. That's why we're going to beat them. Okay. So you see one, two, three down. You see two in the middle. You see apex, apex. This is your corner. That's your corner and safety, safety. Now, later on, when you go into trips, you're going to see a whole bunch of messy things because uh, they overplay the trips with their safety. So we'll be able to take advantage of that too. Before we get going, you have to watch huddle. Okay. That being said, um, in order to get something out of huddle, your coaches have to have stuff ready for you to watch in huddle. Okay. So you just can't watch something. Um, it, it doesn't do you any good unless you know what you're looking for. So what I'm doing now is I'm letting you know what we're going to look for in the scrimmage and then when we play them in the playoffs. What are we looking for? We're looking to pick on these Apex guys. So take a look at what Shano does right here. Shano has twins out here. They've got their corner and a safety, and then they've got their Apex inside. They expect their Apex to look inside, go run to pass, edge to flat. They can't cover this, right? There's always going to be something available in this flat as long as the apex is in. So basically what we're doing with our offense going into the scrimmage is when those apex guys are in, we're going out. And when those apex guys go out, then we're running in between the tackles. Okay, so let's take a look at this. Look at that apex. They expect him to look in the backfield and go edge to flat, can't do it. Oh, always gonna be open. All right, take a look at this up here. We have to identify the three in the middle, one, two, three, and the two linebackers. Those are the things that they don't wanna change. Then we look for the apex, we look for the apex, corner, corner, safety, safety. All right, uh, this apex is inside, we could pick on that. Apex edge to flat, run to pass, it's tough to cover the outs. They're gonna be open all the time. Okay, they can't stop those five yard outs. Look, look, okay. Take a look here. All right, so now we have a trips look. This is what I was talking about before. Look at their safeties. Okay, so they went, they keep their three in the middle, one, two, three, and two, three plus two is five. Then they move their apex player out, apex player out, corner, corner. Now look at the safety. Both safeties are on this side of the field. They shift them over, shift them over. Okay, what does that mean? That means backside up here, this guy is gonna be one on one with the corner. So this is when we start getting into, do you wanna call a hitch? Do you wanna call a fade? Do you wanna call a slant? Do you wanna call a, an out or an under? What are you gonna do with this guy? Because you have to take advantage of that. Okay. Next look. Again, identify where are the three in the middle? One, two, three. Where are the two? So those are the five apex, apex, corner, corner, right there and right there. What I would do, and they I think they come back to this, is you have to take advantage of this flat over here, right? So they do that. I think they throw a screen or something coming back like that. They, they have some, what well, sets up, right? We just miss uh, a block. But if you look in there, that's all available, right? There's only two guys over here and his eyes are here. They just miss, boom, they just miss that block. Otherwise, that's a nice play. All right, so now we have, check this out. You've got your one, two, three, four, five. That never changes. Then you've got your apex, apex. This guy's got to go run to flat or run to pass, edge to flat. We got a lot of space out here, boys. And then this guy's going to be all alone. Look at where the safety is over there. 
that's just going to be tough for them. And they try it. So if you have confidence in your ex, uh, Justin, take that. Do you see the five in the middle? One, two, three, four, five. Apex, apex. And corner, corner. Safety, safety. And Denmark jumped last year. I think we run, they did this like two plays in a row. So this gets back to that snap count. Ben, uh, nothing that comes out of Justin's mouth is going to start the snap. It's only going to be the clap. That's the only thing. So blue, five, blue, eight, go, 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 jump. Doesn't matter until you hear that clap. Okay. And I think they jump on this one as well. Yeah. Okay. This is against Luxembourg Casco. They don't change anything. If we take a look at the defense, we have to identify their five in the middle. One, two, three, four, five. This is their apex player. This is their apex player, corner, corner, safety, safety. All, both safeties are moved all the way over on this side of the field. And this guy's gonna be all alone with this guy. Mm -hmm. And they take a shot. You got that shot, you take that. See what we got here. We got twins. So now what they do, why don't we want to run the ball against this? Well, they've got their one, two, three, four, five. Then they've got this guy running run to pass, edge to flat. He's tucked in here. He's tucked in here. Right? So now they've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, or six if they move him out into the twins, but we only have five blockers up. So the little signage I put is they win six five. So we have to be be able to identify and then pick on where these apex guys are. Okay. We got trips. This doesn't change. One, two, three, four, five. Okay. We have an apex play, or that's five. And then we got the apex player out here and the apex player out here. Now check this out. This apex player is taking away any slant and stuff like that. There's, this is, and your safety's here and your safety's here. You're gonna see this later uh, on your scrimmage tape with Denmark from last year. There's nobody out here. It's one-on-one. -on -one. Can't stop a slant, can't stop a post corner if he turns his hip. Look at that. That's all green grass right there. Especially if you got Chase in the backfield and you've got eyes on Chase. There's going to be nothing there. Identify this defense. You've got one, two, three, four, five. This is your apex. This is your apex. You've got your trips over here. You got your safeties over here. You've got. This guy over here, one on one with the corner. I would take a shot at him right there. Look at him and throw the ball. There's no one there. All right, what do we got? We've got, oh, this is a little bit different because they're in a pro look. I'll skip over that. All right, we've got trips out here. Again, look at your defense. It's always one, two, three, four, five. Then it's going to be apex, apex, corner, corner. We've got safety, safety. This guy is all alone out here. Can you throw a hitch out here? Yes, you can. Then look at this. these are the safeties, right? These are the next closest guys to making a play on this guy right here. That is crazy. Oh, good point. So we have to practice with hashes every day. So we understand like if we smash trips to the boundary um, that we can take advantage of the open field on the field side, get our sa safeties moving over to the boundary and then give our X a whole bunch of room to run. Look at that. Think you could throw a hitch out there, Justin? There is no one there to stop a hitch. Oh my God. Oh, 
we were playing with triple bubble yes or uh, triple GT triple yesterday uh, we're gonna add triple bubble really gonna like this so you put your apex in jeopardy again that's our game plan going into Denmark is how do you make things tough for this guy what if we ran some uh, triple option at him Isn't that cool? He closes that thing down. That's our read key. Pitch keys out here on the bubble. That's cool. We have that in our playbook. All right, what do you got here? We have double twins. Whenever you see Denmark, you look at their offense or you look at their defense, you see three down. And you see two here, they don't like to change that. And then we have an apex, we have an apex. Corner, corner, safety, safety. Apex, run edge to flat, eyes on the quarterback, run the pass. We got that. Come up in twins, we always identify their defense. We see three down, one, two, three. We see two here. You got an apex here and an apex here. Then you got corner, corner, safety, safety. Now, we're gonna talk about this later. Anytime that we try to get out on truck or anytime that we come back like on a uh, Z-Jet, if you have leverage on the apex, again, we're going one man over, one man over, one man over, one man over. We're throwing a truck right now, one man over. If we're going one man over, and if you, Y, have leverage on an apex, just pin him in, right? So just crack him down. Like if he gives that to you, that's an easy block. Boom, look at that. And they're not, our scheme is better than theirs. They're kind of going down, down, up front, and then they're pulling a guy around. So what we can do is we can take our Y and you can crack down on that apex and then we're just going over, 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 over. So we'll have more guys in space than, than uh, Luxembourg does. But it will be available. We start by identifying where there are five guys. They got three in the middle, one, two, three. They got their two, and then they've got their apex and their apex. Now, another thing uh, I'll talk to Coach Shilcox about is when they're trying to cover our trips, they will get crossed up if you run some crossing stuff here. So we kind of see, hope we see something like this against them. Moving ahead. Not a great look, but always identify three down, two, apex, apex, corner, corner, safety. We talked about this before. If you get leverage on an apex and we're trying to get out here in space, crack him down, pin him to the inside. Boom, there we go. We always start by taking a look at one, two, three down, two linebackers, apex and apex. Now check out this apex guy. He looks like he's shaded inside. Maybe it's a bad angle, but that tells me that this flat's available now. Whatever you call out here, if you call a bubble or if you call a bubble um, or an out. So check this, they can't cover this, right? Look at, he's facing in and he's turned this way. You're telling me that he's going to squeeze down, read run, and then get out to the flat to cover and out. Can't do it. This guy's too far in. How is he going to cover the edge, run the pass, and then cover the out? Can't do it. So either way, you could throw this. Those are available. <laughs> All right. Again, we're going to run Z jet back this way. And our linemen are all going one man over, one man over, one man over, one man over. But 
instead of going one man over, if you, H, have leverage on this guy, pin him down. Boom. Isn't that cool? Space is there. We take a look at what they have. They have three down. They've got two up. They got apex, apex. This apex is, again, peaking, turning into the backfield. He cannot cover an out over here. Jumping ahead. Everything starts by finding their three down, their two linebackers, their apex, apex, and then see what they're doing with their safeties. Jumping ahead. This footage wasn't really clear. Uh, I think this is Kohler, Denmark. They ran a lot of empty stuff, so I'll talk to Coach about that. So they ran a lot of, like a lot of quads. They ran trips on one side and they ran twins on the other. Right now this, running a trace, which is we've got a, a tight end and then we've got uh, two backs out here. Mm -hmm. But it's all the same, right? One, two, three, four, five, apex, apex, corner, corner, safety, safety. Okay. Now check this out. They got an apex here. This guy's gonna be one on one on the outside. Again, it, uh, Justin, if you feel like you're confident and you trust your ex, right? Safety's going over, apex is reducing. Take a shot with this guy if you trust him. Especially if they're backing off, right? Hitches are money. Here we go, here's our three down, one, two, three. Here are two, one, two, apex and apex. You're gonna see apex move down on the motion. You're gonna see the safety slide across. You guys, one on one. All right, what do we got here? We've got trips and twins. This is an, yeah, it's an empty set. I don't know why I marked it. Just to let you know, I guess, that really not much changes, right? They're still keeping three, and they're keeping two, and then they're going apex, apex, corner, corner, safety, safety, okay? But no matter how they do this, they're always gonna have a problem with outs, as long as their apexes are staying in. I think that's why I marked this. Yeah, they got problems. Again, you're looking one, two, three, down here, two, three, and then you're looking at four, five, and then their apex, actually it's four, five, because they're shifted over to the trips, and then your apex, apex, as long as that apex guy is inside and they expect him to cover Edge to flat, run the pass. If we can get the ball on a spot, they're going to have problems. Again, how does this guy get into the backfield, reduce or sque uh, squeeze down, and then get out there? That's a problem. Problems for Denmark. Problems for Denmark. What do we got here? We got double twins. I'm looking for my three down, my two linebackers, my apex, and my apex. Oh, look at how far this apex is in. You're telling me that apex is going to be able to cover this flat? I don't think so. This apex is reduced. So race, basically, they got seven guys in their box right now. Let's see if Kohler takes advantage of that or not. They do. Can't cover that. He 
again, get a look. There's your three down. There are your two linebackers, your apex, your apex. And we've got guys out there in twins, and there's no one out there. And they're still covering. They're still eyes in the backfield looking run the pass. Edge to flat. Denmark, if we know what we're looking for, you guys are in trouble. Let's see what we got here. Let's see. I identified their three down, their two, their apex, their apex. I see the corners and the safeties. Oh, look at you, Mr. Apex. We've got a guy out here in the twins and we got the apex inside here. Can you cover this? You cannot cover that. Let's see if Kohler can find that. Come on, Kohler, check into it. I would have checked into it, Kohler. Robbie. Do, 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 do. Let's see what they have here. All right, so they are in double twins, gun back. We've got three down, we've got two, we've got apex, apex. Uh, if we're running anything out here, we can leverage that and pin him in. If we're running back that way, we can leverage down and pin inside. Oh, this is our draw. So what we're going to do, we haven't introduced this yet. But basically on our draw, this back's going out this way. So we're blocking. We can block one, two, three, four, five guys. So we're not going to block that guy. And basically quarterback, it's almost like an RPO draw. Uh, if he jumps out into the flat, you keep it on the draw. If he stays, you can just dump into the flat. See that guy follow? Watch this linebacker right here. He follows the back out into the flat. Yeah, just keep it and go. Now that wasn't a call draw on their part, so they didn't pick up the backer, but you get the idea. All right, everything starts with finding the three and the two and the apex and the apex. Oh, this is, I don't wanna look at that because that's running some tight end stuff. I had a different um, idea about that. Let's see what we got here. We've got double twins. Let's see if we can identify Denmark. Do they have their three down? Yes, they do. Do they have their two in? Yes, they do. Do they have their apex apex? Yes, they do. Is that apex? How do we put him in conflict? How do we put him in conflict? They're staying in the box. Well, let's attack these flats. We can run truck. We can run jet read back or we can throw outs or we can check in the bubbles. Anything to exploit that. See what you guys do. Yes, good for you guys. Can't cover that. <laughs> Let's see if we can identify Denmark's defense. Three down, one, two, three, yes. Two in the middle, yes. Do we find their apex players? Well, so what they will do uh, away from the trips is they'll, um, reduce this guy and they might bring that apex up and this apex is on this side over here now look at this is the middle of the field they pulled their safeties all the way over here which means if you trust your ex throw him the ball you'll figure something out you can run a slant you can run your skinny post hitches always beautiful your outs your unders your fades post corner Look at that. There's no one there. There is no one there. There is no one here. We just have to know what we're looking for, right? What do we have? Let's identify Denmark's defense. Do you see three down? Yes, we do. Do you see two linebackers? Yes, you do. Do you see an apex? Yes, you do. Do you see an apex? Yes, you do.
He just signaled something here, mate. What does he want? He wants something. Coach, coach, coach. I'm not seeing something. I'll come back to that, but I kind of had a little brain fart there. All right, let's take a look at uh, they're in double twins here. Let's see. We've got one, two, three. Yep, three down. We got two in the middle. Yep, we got an apex and an apex. Yep, we got a corner, corner, safety, safety. Okay. Let's put this apex in jeopardy and this apex in jeopardy. I know which one I like. Do you see which one you like? Again, I highlighted those two guys in jeopardy. How do you stop that? You cannot stop that, fellas. If that apex is inside and your coach says to him, uh, we need you to go run to pass, edge to flat, you can't do that. How do you do that? That is what they call stealing. All right, let's identify the defense. Do you see three down? Do you see two in the middle? Yep, there's your apex, there's your apex. What are you doing here? Boy, I like both of them. Let's see if Kohler finds one that they like. Yep. How do you stop that, fellas? You can't do it. All right. Let's see what we see here. Can you identify Denmark's defense? Do you see three down? Yes, I do. Do you see two in the middle? Yes, you do. Do you see apex, apex? Yes, you do. Corner, corner, safety, safety. Apex, you're being asked to go run to pass, edge to flat. Can you cover this guy? I do not think you can cover that guy. And then he's he's uh, coming up here. So this is available too. Quarterback, take your pick. Okay. Cannot stop that. Do you find three in the middle? Yep. You find two? Yep. Do you find your apex? I see one there and one there. Corner, corner, safety, safety. What am I doing here? I'm going one on one and back over here. But oh, uh oh. Little mistake, mix up, confusion. All right, let's see what we got. Do you see three down? Yep, one, two, three. Do you see two in the middle? Two, yep. Do you see apex, apex? Yes, we do. Wait a minute, corner, corner. Can this apex cover this guy in the flat on an out? I do not think he can. Can he cover him on a bubble? I don't. Oh, look at this. Apex, safeties are pulled over. How do you cover that? Don't know. Either side looks good, doesn't it, boys? Oh, they take that one. Good for you, Kohler. Let's identify. Do you see three down? Yep. Do you see two in the middle? Yep, they slid the chips. Do you see apex defenders? There's one over here, there's one over here. Oh, you got an apex here. Look at this, this is a safety. That's a safety. Who's helping this dude out here? Nobody. Let's see if they find it. They found it. Right idea, right boys? All right. Let's identify three down, two in the middle, apex, apex, corner, corner, safety, safety. Safeties are slid over. Who's helping him? Nobody. Think you can hit a hitch out there, Justin? I think you can. What about a slant? Hit a slant there, Justin? I think you can. Do, do, do. Let's identify, boys. We've got three down, we got two. In the middle, we got apex, 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 
Apex, Apex, got a corner, corner, safety, safety. Safeties are slid over to the trips. Oh, who's helping him up here? The answer is nobody, nobody. Boy, the wide open, wasn't it? Mesh routes. Hope you're enjoying this because I love it. Three down, two in the middle. We got an apex. We got an apex. Safeties are slid over. How do you stop this? If you can throw the ball, you they cannot stop that. Let's identify. They got three in the middle. Oh, this is in their uh, quads set. So basically, they emptied the backfield. They got quads over here. I got a split over here. I don't know why I marked it. Oh, I guess that's why I marked it because the amount of the number of times that they offer uh, one on ones available. Let's get into some two river stuff. We'll do our game from last year and then we'll go into our scrimmage. All right, see if you can identify. So they have three down. So maybe this isn't a great one because we're playing with the tight end now, but they have three down. They'll have two in the middle. They'll have their apex and then the apex corner, corner, safety, safety. I guess the reason I marked that is on this backside over here. If you got the apex pulled in, he's all alone and not getting help. So if you can run slant here, if you can run hitch back here, especially if they're backpedaling. Look at that. Can't stop a hitch there. Right? Let's get into more like spread looks, some some twins and some trips. When you hear coaches call formations, anytime it starts with a TR, it means three. So you might hear them say trace, uh, tray, trick, trips, truck, right? That's all three guys on one side. So this is a trips formation out here. Let's identify, do they keep things the same? Oh, look at that boys, three down, one, two, three, two here, apex and an apex, okay. They get corner, safety's pulled over to the middle, safety's pulled over to the trips. And who's helping him? Say it with me. Nobody. Nobody. Look at that dude. Throw the ball. Justin, throw the ball. Justin, throw the ball. Their eyes are on Chase. Throw the ball. There he is. Hmm. What do we got here boys let's see if we can identify we got three down one two three yes we do we got two there we got an apex player here and then their apex players over there and corner corner safety safety safety's in the middle of the field and what do you think apex hitch i don't know why i spelled hitch like that throw it boom can't stop that Whatever they give us, right boys? All right, three down, two in the middle, apex, apex. I'm No, I'm skipping that one, that's a big pistol. I wanna stick to spread looks. There we go. All right, we got, we got doubles pistol. All right, three down, I see him. Two in the middle, I see him, apex, apex. I see him. Ooh, you know what? You're telling me he's gonna be able to cover, chase, edge to flat, run to pass if we're running an out. You can't stop an out. They can't stop an out against you guys. 
if you run a five little spot out. Cannot do it. It's got to know what you're looking for, right? All right, let's see if we can identify the defense. DC three down, yep, DC two in the middle, yep. You see your apex, yep, corner, corner, safety, safety. Ooh, you know what? They're slow to motion, right? So they, they're really not moving, they're kind of adjusting, but they kind of don't. So let's get back to this. If you're ever this guy, if you're ever the H or if you're ever the Y, and you look at that apex player, how do you know where he is? Down, 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 middle, middle, apex, apex, corner, corner, safety. So if you can pin an apex down, if we're running some kind of truck, or on this side, some kind of jet read, pin him down. Okay. Now, why is that flat available? That flat's available because they really don't adjust to motion and he still has edge to flat responsibilities. So he's still playing inside out. Squeeze, 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 squeeze. Then he's got to get out there. That's a tough assignment. Their apex players, they must feel really good about them because they're asking them to do a lot. Okay. All right, see if you can identify. One, two, three in the middle, one, one, two guys, or three down, two in the middle, apex, apex. Uh, can this guy cover this out? He cannot. Now this is gonna look like what our snake is kinda gonna look like, right? When, when he's just gonna sit and he's gonna sit a yard behind him. Check this out. Boom. Who's there? Nobody. Isn't that cool? All right, what do we got here? This is hard to see, but we got three, two, apex, apex, and then over here we've got corner, corner, safety in the middle, safety to the trip, All right? And one on one over here again, you'll see it in the other view. All right, check this out. We see three down, we see two in the middle, we see apex, apex. This is the safety, boys. And the other safety is over here, the corner's here. This corner over here, one on one. There's no help. Can't stop that. Why did I highlight this one? All right, let's identify the defense. Do we see, yeah, we see one, two, three down. We see two in the middle. We see apex, apex. We see a safety up here. What are we looking at here? Oh, I highlighted this because this is the screen we tried to run. Look how they're being coached. This guy is saying, find Chase and follow him. It's a pretty good job on his part. So either he sniffed that thing out or he was coached. They're well coached, I'm guessing he was coached that way. Okay, what do we got here? Do you identify three down? Yep, two, yep, apex, apex, yep, corner, safety, safety, corner. Nobody helps that guy. How do you stop in that? Huh, there's nothing there. Their eyes are on, Ju are on Ju Chase and Justin. They're not seeing this. Again, down, down, down. Middle, middle, apex, apex, corner. Watch, boom. Eyes are on Justin and Chase. And you've got all of this grass. I think next we'll jump to our scrimmage. Show you a couple clips here. Same thing, boys. One, two, three, down, two in the middle. They took this apex and they put him down there. Kind of like an eagle look. They put this apex out here. Corner, safety, safety, corner. Look at this corner. This will be the next guy closest to this to make this tackle. And these guys are on the other side of the field. 
okay, I did over here. Justin, if you pick this, middle, middle, down, 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 apex, apex. Look at this, safety, safety. This is the only guy here. Think you can beat him on a fade? Post corner. Down, 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 middle, middle, apex, apex. Can they cover an out here? They cannot. Can he cover an out here? He cannot cover an out there, especially if they have to go edge to flat, run to pass. And then this is my second worst spelling of the day. There is flat confusion. So what they're asking their apex guys to do is they're saying, okay, you run edge to flat, you run run to pass, and then if you read pass, I want you also to collide. And they did this more in the, in the beginning of the season, in their earlier games, in their later games. But then they said, we want you to collide this guy. So this guy just gets mixed up. And again, with all this stuff going on here, this flat will be available. See him? He got twisted around. Now, it's not like this great play that we're looking for here, but it's available because that flat's open, right? All right, let's see if we can identify the defense. I see one, two, three down. I see two in the middle. I see... That's a pro set. I'm going to skip that one. Sorry, boys. Double twins. We like that one. Okay, so we got three down. We got two in the middle. We've got apex and apex. Can this apex cover this flat? He cannot. That's where I would start picking on that guy right out there. Now, if he wants to widen out, that's one guy out of the box. Now we can just start running whatever we want inside the tackles. Can that guy cover this flat? He cannot cover this flat. And that's why that flat's available, right? He's in conflict. It's just mixed up. Same thing, right? They're asking this guy, run the pass, edge the flat. What crossed up he gets out there? Few more boys. Who's out there? Oh my gosh. Can you imagine this? If you called a bubble on this, Justin, we've got this uh, trips look out here, and you've got, you called a two on a bubble. Who's out there? The answer? No one. Can't cover it. I like this too, right? Safety, safety. One on one over here. Take a shot. Make them pay for their insolence. All right, three down, two up. Uh, they have apex, apex. This guy, apex is not helping over here. We've got safety, safety. This guy's one on one. Think you can hit a hitch there, Justin? Slant? Think so. And outs are always going to be a problem for them as long as they keep asking so much of those apex players. Identify one, two, three down, two up, apex, apex. This apex is inside of our twin. So we have this available on the outs out here. They move in, we throw out. They move out, we throw in. And again, if we're running any kind of like sweep or truck or jet read up to you, and if you have the ability as a Y or an H to crack and pin, do that. Take that, take care of that apex. Boom. Look nice, we went one man over with our tackle there. So we almost, we have like a double on that apex.
Leverage, you got it, take it. Boom. Let's do a couple more here, fellas. See if we can identify. Uh, we got one, two, three down, two in the middle. We got apex, apex, corner, corner, safety, safety. Look at that, we missed the, um, we missed any kind of crack on that guy. It's just a tough assignment though for the apex guys. Put their apex in uh, jeopardy. Make it tough for them. Wow. Three down, two up. Apex, apex, corner, corner, safety, safety. He's on here. He, he's either going to be cracking him on something or can't stop this. So this flat should be available. So let's see if this flat's available. That flat's available, right? It's open. Check out this one. Um, let's see if we identify. We see three down. Do we see two up? Oh, look at Didn't only saw this a couple times. They took one of their um, linebackers and put him down. Make a four man front. Apexes are still here and here. All we have is three down with an extra linebacker down. So they got a four man front. Apex, apex. But the apexes are still going to be put in jeopardy, right? That flat should be open. That's open. This guy's coming through. That's open. We can get the ball there. If you have leverage on an apex, take it. If we're trying to get to the outside. Let's see, did this guy take it? Boom, he did. Keep your head in the front, right? That's a nice angle. Boom. Stay there, stay there, stay there. Then that should be available. It should be open. Uh, can't stop oats. Especially when the that apex is playing so far inside. Look at him. Re boom. Get there. Can't get there. And I'd make those a little bit shorter. Maybe make those about five. You'll get them every time. All right. One, two, three. One, two. Apex, apex. Corner, corner. Safety, safety. Our double twins. Justin, there, Justin, you're going to be doing that all scrimmage. Check that out. If that apex player is not helping and this guy is one on one, man, you got so much grass out there. You got hitches out there. You've got slants out there. Whatever you want. Pitch and catch, right? Stealing. Check that out. Look at all that grass. Go. Should be fun. All right, I gotta go to practice. It's like 2.38 right now. So I'm gonna stop this and I'm gonna hang this up tonight. Do you get the idea? I hope you do. So just identify uh, Denmark where they're at, three down, two up. Identify where their apex guys are. If they're in, we go out. If they're out, we go in. They cannot stop outs. And if we're ever in trips and the safeties switch over, that X is going to be isolated. Sound good? And watch film. And uh, if your coaches are telling you to watch film and they're not putting anything together for you, um, they got to put something together for you so you know what you're looking for. All right, fellas. All right.
have a good day and I'll see you in about 20 minutes. Yeah.